Happy Hatters, how are we doing? We're back again with the vlogs. It's been a few weeks. It's Swindon at home today. Um, I was on holiday a couple of weeks ago, so I missed Colchester. But I'm back today for Swindon, hoping for a good result. I'm going to go with 2 0 win for the Hatters. Hilton scoring a brace. He's right by us, actually, so I might see if I can get a word with him. See you guys in a sec. Hatters, I'm here with Danny Hilton. Can I get a score prediction, please? 3 uh, 0 to us. Reckon you'll score? Hat trick, yeah. Uh, nah, cheers, you better say that. Nah. Take that bit off, yeah. Take nah, that bit keep off. it in. You heard it from the man himself. Hatters, I'm here with Luke Gambin. We... What was it like playing for Malta the other day? Yeah, it was alright, but I didn't play, so. Yeah, I know I'll I'll come see you on, on the bench. In a bit. Yeah, I know I'll see you come on in the second game. Yeah. I was hoping you come on against England to be fair. Yeah, I was hoping too. But nah, it was, nah, but it's good though still. Cheers. Good luck today. Nice one. Cheers, mate. 2 0 us. 2 0 to Luton, yeah? Yeah. Who's your record on the score? Danny Hilton. Danny Hilton. James Collins. Is he fit, is he? Huh? Is he fit? That's what I'd say, won't we? Ah, uh, he's not going too much away. <laughs> Hilton said, yeah. Ah, cheers. Cheers, mate. Hilton's apparently what? said Danny Hilton will be uh, Danny I'm Hilton. Like Collins will sorry be fit. Uh, for the game today. Decent. Hatters, I'm here with George and Freddie. Guys, what do you think the score will be today? Five. Three one to Luton. Three one to Luton, who's gonna score? Yeah. Uh uh Glenn. Patrick Patrick Collins. Collins with a hat trick? What do you what do you reckon, little man? Glenn. Glenn Ray's gonna score. What do you reckon the score's gonna be? Um, 5 0. 5 0? Ben Ray's going to score five goals, is it? We'll have to wait and see, but I hope so too. Come on, you hatters. Score prediction. Hatters, I'm here with Alan Sheehan. What do you reckon the score is going to be today? Uh, hopefully 2 0. 2 0. Who's going to score? Um, me and Colin. Is, what, are you from a corner, yeah? Or a free kick? Yeah, maybe, yeah. Hopefully. Hatters, I'm here with another Luton player. What do you reckon the score is going to be today? 3-0. 3 0 Three nil. Hopefully, yeah. Who's going to score? Glenn 3. 3, yeah? Yeah, 3 from Glenn. Decent, decent. <laughs> Fair enough. Hatters, I'm here with uh, James Collins. He's just trying to get in the picture. James, can I get a score prediction, please? 2-0. Um, 2-0 to Luton. Are you going to score today? Yeah. Are you fit, are you fit to play? <laughs> he says he's going to score today. Decent, he's confident, so am I. Hatters, I'm here with Pelly Ruddock. What's your score prediction for today's game? Uh, I think it's going to be about 4-1. 4-1, you reckon you're going to score? Hopefully 1 and Hilton 2 and James Collins 1. Is he fit, is he? Yeah, I think so, yeah. yeah so hopefully fine. he score. Cheers, right. thank you. Cheers, thank you. Hatters, I'm here with Frankie Masanda. What's your score prediction for today? 3-0 Luton. 3-0, who's going to score? Uh, Collo will get one. Hilton will get one. Uh, cheers. <laughs> See you later. Hatters, I'm here, we're back in. Can I get a score prediction, please? Uh, I'm going to say 2 0 to us. Who's going to score? Uh, Hilton. I'm going to go 2 to Hilton, yeah. 2 to Hilton, Hilton yeah. Two, yeah. Big man. <laughs> Alright, cheers. All right. I've got the Hatters team news here. Um, is Stetching Gold, Stacey, Sheehan, Cuthbert, Potts, Alan McCormack, Ollie Lee, Pelly, Shinny, Collins, and Hilton. Collins does start. There's your hat as lineup. That's how Sorry. 20 minutes to kick off. Come on, Town, it's a strong team. Town nil, Swindon one. Cuthbert getting um, sent off for a high boot. Penalty sent steps the wrong way. 1 0. And um, because of the red card, there's been a change. Uh, Shinny coming off. He was only half fit anywhere, apparently. And Glenray coming on. Look at the ready. Uh, Luke in the ring here, sorry. Uh, Hilton on the ball now. Pelly on the edge of the box. Ball in the box. Late at penalty. Ow! Disgrace! have just had a blatant penalty denied. Blatantly, absolutely pathetic. 1-0 Swindon. This ref is a joke. Pathetic. Hatters, 
half time, Luton nil, Swindon won. This ref is an embarrassment. How we haven't had about four penalties. Uh, it's absolutely pathetic. The first one, Hilton's about to have a shot and he's pulling, basically all over him, pulling him down. Don't give nothing. Second one, push him straight in the back with a forearm. Third one, uh, it's debatable, but you can see him given. And the fourth one, from the corner, just gets pulled down by his shirt again. We don't get anything. These refs are a joke. I don't know my language, but we, um, we always uh, say it and we always get shit refs. It's true. Our refs are atrocious. This guy should be a ban for life refereeing. There's, um, we're sitting with some Swindon fans who are wheelchair users, and their carer was saying they get him quite a lot. Um, and he was saying um, this is the first game that we've actually been favouring towards Swindon. Which is, um, he says something, but he, he's very one sided referee, looking at me to loot and all spending. But apart from the referee, that red card has killed the game. Shinny went off for a raid to come into the fence. We've got no creativity now, no one to thread the balls through. Pelly's out wide uh, trying to get things going, but he's not really doing much. But I, you can't really blame him because he's a wide player. But Hilton and Colin are very much the same player, so they're sort of doing the same thing, and there's no one getting in behind. Um, I'd possibly bring on um, Cornick for a better pace, get him in behind. When we started doing that, they couldn't handle us. Um, to be fair, um, we haven't looked that good since sending off, but I think. What do you expect? Uh, so it's good the game. But um, uh, I'm not going to go on about it for too long. I won't have been back for about two minutes. So um, apart from that, uh, apart from the first five minutes, not much happened really. Um, it's been more about the referee than anything else. But anyway, guys, uh, that's me done for half time. I'll update you anything that goes on in the second half as per usual. See you guys in a bit. Second change for the town. Holly Lee coming off and Harry Cornick coming on. Going for the three up top. Still 1 0. Luton 0, Swindon 2. They're number three with a banger. No complaints. Bronze at the defence. Smashed that across goal. Decent goal. No complaints. Swindon fans are giving it large, but it doesn't matter. We've got 10 men. The referee's been against us the entire game. Again, we still had a handball penalty uh, minutes into the first half. A fair play, Swindon. Good second goal. 2 0. Well, well, this is embarrassing. Luton 0, Swindon Town 3. Whoever their number seven is tapping in. Uh, whoever it was getting in. Go on the right hand side, in behind. Slide it across the lane up the seven. It's all kicking off uh, with the fans. Um, the swing have been much better than the second half. Been really, really um, just lethal. The goal, really. You know, a lot better than us. 3 0, no way back. Sub for the town, Luke Berry on, Hilton off, still 3 0. Full time, Luton 0, Swindon 3. That was horrendous. That second half was an embarrassment. Uh, Luton didn't look interested. Swindon in the first 10 minutes took the game by storm, scored the two goals, and then the game was over. Fair play, Swindon, you were the better team, no complaints. I'm back here midweek with Port Vale. It's going to be hopefully better than that. But if you've enjoyed the video, leave a like, comment about the game, what you thought on it, where we're going to finish, that kind of thing. Subscribe to the channel and one more thing, it was apparently a deliberate handball for the Kafka um, signing off, but from where I was, it looked like somebody got in for a tackle. So, my mistake, handball was for the tackle, we were shite, spending were better than those, fair play. See you guys later, peace.